Welcome back, nerds. It's Nick here with another Skylanders three-star walkthrough. Uh, starting it off fast with Oil Spill Island. You're going to just have to turn around to grab the story scroll in this one. Then uh, you want to proceed through the main gate almost, right up to after this little pirate ship here. You can unlock this gate. It doesn't really need to be unlocked, but it just gives you an intro on the uh, push puzzles in this one. You want to grab your water Skylander to go ahead and grab the first soul stone in this level and just an FYI you're going to want that water Skylander handy through this level because the only way to get the soul stones is with one. And right after you get out of the water uh, grabbing that first soul stone, you're going to find the first chest, so go ahead and swap to your Skylander that needs the most money, or has the least, and go ahead and grab that one. And then we just proceed through the level as normal, with a couple more push puzzles that are pretty easy to solve, given that the little diamond crystal things can't be moved too far out of the uh, original placement. Um, I went ahead and cut out most of the little in-game cinematics for you. Uh, so we can make this quicker. Um, then you want to turn around the corner here, walk down, and you're going to pick up uh, the second and final soul stone uh, down in the water around the corner uh, for Boomer. Um, then you just want to proceed back up to the top, walk over the dock, and you're going to grab your second treasure chest. Now we come to the fire gate, which is easily the most annoying puzzle in the game because you get reset if you don't make all your turns right. So I went ahead and did it a couple times and edited a video together for you guys so you can get the hat as well as the legendary treasure all in one try if you watch what turns I made. The game pretty much gives you the third and final treasure chest. All you have to do is drop a little bomb on a guy to go pick it up. You don't even have to fight any of the baddies on this portion of the level. Um, and you're automatically teleported here. So within a couple playthroughs, you should have a three-star completion for this level. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.